Let's take a look at uploading some files into the web server and then viewing them out on the web. I have my Wanderlust Travel website all set up here and I did install and give Dreamweaver the information to connect with my web server. Now how do I go about doing that? Well, the easiest method is to just choose some files from within my local files panel. Since this is the first time I'm going to upload information, I have to be careful how I'm going to do this. And because I have so many files here, I don't really need to upload everything to the server. Normally, if this was your first time uploading, you'd want to upload everything. So what I'm going to do is limit this to my home page for now. So how do I do that? I'm going to select my home page, which is index, and I'm going to click the blue arrow that says put. Notice it says put files to the remote server. I'll go ahead and do that. Now it's asking me about dependent files. I will say yes, since this is the first time. While it's uploading those, I'll give you an idea of what a dependent file is. A dependent file is a file that this page needs in order to work correctly out on the web. So let me go out into Firefox and go ahead and preview this. So I'll go out to Firefox, I'll plug in my web address, and that will be cmarscreate.com, and this will be Wanderlust, and let's see the file. Guess what? There it is. Now because I said upload the dependent files, my images were uploaded, my styles were uploaded. You can see my navigation doesn't quite have all of the styles in it, so I'll have to check that out. But if I scroll, even my slideshow is all set up. Dreamweaver asked me about it, knew exactly which files to upload, and my page is all set. So I can use the files panel Whatever files I select within this panel, those are the files that when I click the blue arrow are going to go up to my web server. I can have this file open and accomplish the same thing if I go up to Site, Put. So if the files open in Dreamweaver right here, I can go up to the Site menu and choose Put and it would upload it exactly the same way. What I tend to do is if it's a single file, I'll quite often have it open. I've just modified it and then I'll go in this direction. If I want to upload a bunch of files, I'll go ahead and select them within the files panel and click the blue put. But it's as easy as that to upload to your web server using Dreamweaver. I had it all set up. The web server information was there. My connection was working, so I select the file, click the blue arrow to put it onto my server. Just make sure you always go out into the browser to double check and make sure it's looking fine once it's out on the web. But that is how you upload a file to the web server.